Hi again. So this is our second to be continued um, enjoyment of the book by Charlie Maskey. The boy, the mole, the fox, and the horse. And um, it's just nothing. So we ended it at one of our greatest freedoms is how we react to things. And if you remember when that was being said, it was right after the mouse decided, the mole rather, decided that he would still regardless chew the fox free and risk the fact that the fox may be able to eat him. So the next little bit this book says is, I've learned how to be in the present. How? asked the boy. I find a quiet spot and I shut my eyes and I breathe. That's good. And then, then I focus. What do you focus on? Cake, said the mole. That mole sure does like cake. And here's the pictures. Isn't it odd we can only see our outsides, but nearly everything happens on the inside. I love that one. And here they are. They're looking into perhaps their reflection, I imagine, in the water. It looks to be like a river. Be careful not to fall. Oh. oh no. It appears as though the mole has fallen. But then what is happening here? It looks like the fox saves the mole. And sure enough, here they are. It looks as though they're ending the day and looking at the skylight and it says, so much beauty we need to look after. That is true. So much beauty that we need to look after in each other and on our planet. So here they are, they're walking along again, the three of them. It says here, being kind to yourself is one of the greatest kindnesses, says the mole. We often wait for kindness, but being kind to yourself can start now, said the mole, can start right now. Often the hardest person to forgive is ourselves. Sometimes I feel lost, said the boy. Me too, said the mole. But we love you, and love brings you home. And here they are. Sitting on a tree. I think everyone is just trying to get home, said the mole. Hello! Who are they saying hello to? It appears as though they've met the horse. Doing nothing with friends is never doing nothing, is it? Asked the boy. No, said the mole. And here they are. They look like they're kind of doing nothing together. Oh, and here they are doing something. Looks like they're running. You fell, but I got you. Looks like the boy fell. Everyone is a bit scared, said the horse, but we are less scared together. Tears fall for a reason. They are your strength, not your weakness. That's coming from a very big animal, a very strong animal, a horse. 
How about we leave it there today? Tears fall for a reason, and they are your strength. They are your strength, not your weakness. Blessed be. Till next time.